I purchased one of the first generally available Behringer Victor oscillators. This digital oscillator is modeled after the 1986 Prophet VS from sequential circuits. It is a quad oscillator which implements what was called vector synthesis. It contains 128 digital waveforms, four of which can be mixed with the included joystick. It was the precursor to the Korg wave station which was introduced in the early 1990s. This is a Eurorack module which represents the VCO portion of the Pro VS Mini synthesizer which Behringer recently released. Let's get it installed and take a listen. So we've installed the Victor Quad Oscillator in the System 55. We're going to listen to the mix output directly. And the first thing you'll notice is that as I change this joystick position, the harmonic content will change. And that's the coolest thing about the oscillator. Now let's take that output and route it into a filter and voltage controlled amplifier. And we're going to add a control voltage from the sequencer. We've been mixing four oscillator outputs. The waveforms and tuning are all configurable parameters. There are a total of 128 waveforms from which to choose. When you combine all of the configurable parameters, we have what's called a program or preset on the Victor module. There are 32 programs within the Victor module. Let's quickly go through the factory default programs. So we've looked at the joystick for manually mixing the four waveforms. This concludes the unboxing video, but we'll be looking at this module in depth. The topics we'll cover include the entire user interface, including the screen, buttons, status LEDs, and menus. All control inputs and outputs. Multiple use cases for exploring the capability of this powerful oscillator. External software including number one, Synth Tribe, 
for sending and receiving programs to a computer or to a Pro VS Mini. And number two, an inexpensive editor. Subscribe and hit the notification bell so you won't miss a single video in this series. Thanks for watching.